when I'm over here making a reservation and I'm making sure that I document this. Yeah, I'm live right now. He was following me on Instagram. I saw him on Instagram when I was over here and I caught him dead in the act because he was watching my account and he watched how I posted Palms, Las Vegas uh, Hotel because I didn't want anybody bothering me because I have a right to not be bothered. So I'm just making sure I document all of this, cross my eyes and post and uh, cross my T's. And I'm also going to put a post on Instagram as well to tell everybody to watch this. For you fuck motherfuckers who don't have nothing to do at, what time is this? At 3.28 in the morning. You have nothing better to do. So you look at you on YouTube. Look at you. Motherfuckers ain't got shit better to do. Get a fucking life. Don't worry about what I got in my account. Let me just tell you, Dash App works. Mind your business. What's your last name? I'm not giving it to you. I'm, if I have to leave for absolutely no reason because I'm being stalked on social media, okay. that's the only reason why he came over here. Mm -hmm. And that's the only reason why he's bothering me. I have no problem leaving the property. Okay. I just don't appreciate being harassed over nothing. Okay. I'm and I've already documented this on all my other social medias, oh, okay. including YouTube. So 167,000 people saw this. Okay. I'm being harassed for no reason. The thing is, Nobody from the hotel came over here to tell me anything. I wasn't obstructing anything. I wasn't bothering anything. Nobody approached that gentleman over there about how long he's been down here. But That man right there? Yeah. He no. should check people in. Well, no, but nobody, there was people sitting over there. Nobody approached them. Nobody said anything. But because I'm posting on my social media and I have a following and I'm telling my truth, I'm being bothered. And I'm also being harassed because I'm tagging 50 Cent in my post. And that's what... 50 Cent? The rapper? Yeah, I know you don't know him. It's great. But I do know him. And I have a right to post what I want to post about social media. Yeah. yeah, I do. And it's interesting how people only call the police, like you, when I do that. And it's coming from random people who don't even know me. Well, here's the thing, man. It's not just regular people. It's the security. No, that guy was watching me on social media, and I saw him on the phone okay. laughing, looking at his Instagram account. Okay. I saw that. All right. Well, point being, it's a private business. Yeah, I, I get it. We can yeah, we can do this. Service. I can go up the street. I can okay. do all of that. It's not that I'm tied specifically to this location. I could really give a shit. I'm just... It's about my rights being violated over bullshit. Your that really... My rights are so being violated. We're letting you know you need to pack your stuff in. My, my rights are being violated, but it's okay. It's okay. I just want to make sure I have a record of this. Because what I'm doing is showing young kids what really happens when you're black. How people really want to do that hurry up and buy nigga shit when it comes to spending your money in establishments. The fact that I'm not being treated like a regular customer like everybody else is because I post it on social media is flat out bullshit. And I want to show everybody that I'm packing everything up. I did turn my laptop off before anybody else is, whatever. And see, this is the thing. This is how I know that these crazy people are calling and doing shit at 3 in the morning. They're anticipating this. also happen to know that I'm being followed on social media by undercover police officers. And because I'm vocal about that, that really pisses them off as well.
drop something. People are watching this with anticipation is real sick, but <laughs> whatever gets your rocks off. She strikes again. She strikes again doing nothing. Let me flip the camera so y'all see everything. I'm not gonna stop filming. Yeah, I already experienced what happened when you stopped filming. So that's not gonna happen. It's amazing. A place that I'm gonna spend money at. A place that I'm going to spend money at. And all of a sudden, I'm criminal. What are they doing? What are they doing? What is he doing? This isn't criminal trespassing? For them? For real? You see how everybody camped out? But mine is criminal trespassing. Get the fuck out of here. I'm not about to be judged by a bunch of random strangers on the internet who probably live with their motherfucking mama. Shut the fuck up, number one. Number two, that still doesn't make what they did right. Then, like, how much you spend at a place doesn't constitute being stalked on social media and that's being okay. Not that. 